channel. Thank you again for stopping by. In this video, uh, I can't believe it is almost the end of October. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm going to be talking about some of the current facial oils that I am using. A lot of mature community YouTubers use facial oils for various reasons. Um, uh, to get ready at night, nighttime routine, daytime routine, whatever. And I recently bought a facial oil that I am absolutely in love with. And it's a blend of oils. And I was thinking to myself, should I do a dedicated video just for this facial oil? Or should I do a video encompassing what I currently use? Because I do do kind of like a round robin where I go around and depending on what my skin needs are for that evening or as I'm getting ready, I will go ahead and pick out a certain oil to, you know, to help my skin along. So uh, I've got about four oils here lined up for you guys to look at. I'm going to put on my trusty little glasses because I can't see a blessed thing with these contacts in today. So, um... If I need to read anything, it's going to be, you know, with these little specs on. So just a fair warning. Uh, and I've also got my little cup here, my NFL cup. Courtesy of my husband um, for any kind of uh, drinking or purposes like that. So let's get started in no particular order. These are really what I'm currently using and also going into the fall season. So that is the that is the premise for the types of oils that I tend to use during these fall and winter months. So um, first one up that I want to show you is the Derma E. I've had this uh, for a number of years I've I've uh, you know bought them over and over again. Derma E is one of the best of uh, product lines that you can have and they're very solid they're available in uh, health food stores I know they're available in sprouts at uh, whole whole foods uh, fresh market that's around us um, I believe also some of the drug stores like Walgreens and CVS etc etc it's the anti-wrinkle vitamin A and E treatment oil and basically it has two oils in it vitamin A and vitamin E and it's one of the lighter oils in my mind because it's like it kind of uh to me it's not a goopy type of oil so it's very easy to put on you only need a couple of drops of this and uh oh i didn't bring like a, a tissue paper do i have tissues around here no i don't but um i'll try to put just a little it's it's got that kind of a top to it and i'm just gonna put just a tiny bit on my uh, back of my hand here so you guys can see it uh, it will shine up because it is a very lubricating oil uh, it you know it almost uh, to me it has a nice slip to it and it it feels almost a little bit warm when you put it on your skin and that's just because it's absorbing that well and it's just really hydrating it's just an absolutely beautiful blend of oils I love blended oils because they give you the benefits of the multiple types of oils that are in it and the multiple vitamins that are in it. So again, this is a vitamin A and vitamin E oil. And you know, vitamin E is really good for anti-wrinkles. So is vitamin A. They just kind of like uh, play very well together. And Derma E has a really great ability to just uh, manufacture these type of uh, blends that just work very very well by the way none of this is sponsored they don't know me these are just my own uh, things out of my cabinet upstairs in my bathroom so uh, yeah this is totally my own thing the next one up and I know you've heard me talk about this all the time is the jojoba oil this one is the organic version and it's by Aura Cassia, I think is the name of the um, manufacturer. Skincare oil. There's only one ingredient in here, and that's the jojoba oil. Just show you guys up there. And uh, this one is, I believe, six ounces. No, four ounces. Four fluid ounces, 118 milliliters, USDA organic. And you do want to get organic where possible. 
Uh, this has the little bunny rabbit seal of approval on it. Um, all kinds of other stuff. And again, it has got one ingredient and that is organic jojoba oil. Now, if you know anything about, uh, I'll put a little over here. If you know anything about jojoba oil, it is uh, supposedly the closest match to your natural skin oils. So it um, basically your skin cannot tell the difference between jojoba oil and your own uh, skin's sebum, your own skin's oil. So it works very well in uh, just hydrating your skin and keeping it in there and just getting into those layers. I love jojoba oil. You can also use it on your hair. And yes, uh, my hair color has changed. It is a kind of a, she was going for the reddish blonde, but I think she went a little darker than reddish blonde. So I'm just gonna say, reddish but uh yeah it does help if you um you know put it on your on your fingertips and then just massage it into your uh into your hair really nicely at night uh you can even put like a little bonnet on your head and then go to sleep like that it is absolutely fabulous as far as that type of oil is concerned okay the next oil i want to show you guys is actually a retinol uh, and it's based in an oil and I really really love this guys you know I've mentioned this one before as well it's the Neutrogena rapid wrinkle repair retinol oil it's actually an oil based you know retinol in it I'm sure it's got vitamin A and all of that let me put on this light here and make sure I can read this uh, just directions you know put it on uh, it says a couple of drops you know uh, three to four drops Massage it into your skin with your fingertips. Uh, and ingredients is uh, just some of the uh, oils here. I think vitamin E, of course, and then the vitamin A for the retinol and all of that. I think, I don't know if there's a vitamin E in it actually, but I know there's vitamin A. Okay, so anyway, this is how it comes. This is how it looks like. One of my favorites, guys. It's It has this little thingy part I don't even know what it's called it's not a pipette it's maybe it is I'm not sure there you go you can suck up a little of the oil there if you can see that and then you just basically put a couple of drops you know on your hands and then massage it into your skin it does have um, a stronger variety I guess of vitamin A that's the reason it's a retinol vitamin and um, you just put it on your skin uh, I do find that I obviously need to use sunscreen if I'm uh, in the mode of using this oil because it does tend to uh, make your skin more sensitive to the sun, it makes it pinker. So just uh, be warned if you are using this retinol oil based, uh, you know, uh, Neutrogena um, bottle, it is going to make your skin a little more sensitive. So. Uh, but I love it. I absolutely adore it. And yes, it will be coming into the winter months for me. And then the last one, oh my gosh, I found this at Sprouts. I paid like $23, $24 for it. And I'm telling you, it smells wonderful. There's two varieties. The variety that I got was um, the Sea Buck, Sea Buck Thorn oil it's a face oil it's by badger this is it right here it's all organic it's got you know um it's gluten free it's bunny friendly it's organic it is an absolutely wonderful wonderful oil there it is and it comes in two varieties it comes in the sea buckthorn and it comes in the rosehip oil now i have rosehip oil from before I didn't bring it down today because it's just not one of the ones that I'm going to be kind of I'm going to be using it sparingly but these are the ones that primarily I will be going into the fall winter months rosehip I tend to use in the spring summer I don't know why it just has that wonderful floral uh, scent to it and I just I really like it for the spring summer uh, yeah it's just my preference uh, but the sea buck uh, sea yeah, sea buckthorn oil. Oh, it smells so nice. And 
This one has a variety of oils in it. It's got a ton of different oils in it. I'm going to try to read this as best as I can. It's got jojoba. It's got something called ben, benhab. It's, called, it's got apricot, apricot kernel, um, oh, pomegranate, uh, what else, what else? Um, orange, uh, vitamin E from sunflower. It's got geranium oil. It's got a little bit of rose hip. It does have that, but not predominantly. It's like 10th or 11th down on the list. Uh, I'm looking under here. And it's got a um, lenolin in it. It's got, uh, I believe, I'm not sure if it has a little... No, it doesn't have lavender oil. It's got something else in it that I can't read. But, it's it, yeah, it's just got about, I would say, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's got about ten different oils in it. I kid you not, ten different oils in a blend. It's got a pump in it, which I really, really love. I'll put a little on my hand just over here, sparingly so you guys can see it. It's a little bit runny, um, and it's just, it smells so heavenly. Guys, this is the one, oh my gosh, this is the one that I've been turning to when I put on my uh, Differin or if I use my Retin-A, my prescription Retin-A. I let my Retin-A sink in or I let the Differin sink in, and then at night I literally have this on my nightstand and while in bed, after about 15, 20 minutes, uh, letting the Retin-A and, and or the different uh, work its magic, I put this oil on afterwards on my face. And oh, oh, just the smell of it, just the luxurious. I feel so pampered, honestly, with this oil. I really do. And again, I'm not sponsored by any of these. I just absolutely happen to trip over it at Sprouts while I was doing my, you know, my other shopping. And, um, you know, my, my husband was with me and he goes, you need another oil, facial oil, like you need a hole in the head. I mean, you really don't need another one. And it's like $24. So he was like, he was kicking up like a mule, I'll tell you, with, with the angst about spending that kind of money. But once I, uh, once I looked at the tester, and they do have the testers in the front there, usually Sprouts is really good about putting testers on. Once I smelled it and once I put it on my hand, I was like, okay, I'm sold. I'm sold. I need to have this. Need to, need to have this. So these are it. These are the four. I didn't want to stay on too long. Let me know what your favorites are, what you're going into for the season, for winter and, uh, and fall what type of oils you are using. I would love to know. I'd love to uh, have a conversation about that. And uh, that's it. I love you guys very much. Thank you again for subscribing. I am going to be doing a uh, giveaway video, so stay tuned for that. It's probably up already because I think I'm going to put this one up after the giveaway video. So for those of you that are interested in the items that I'm giving away, for the 4,000 subscriber, um, thank you that uh, I've gotten over 4,000 subscribers now. Very appreciative uh, of you guys, and there'll be multiple winners. That much I can tell you. Um, I'm sorting out all of the stuff and trinkets and skincare and things like that that I'm going to be providing for the giveaway, but I'm very excited about it. And I love you guys very much, and I just appreciate every each and every one of you, and it's the least I can do to do a cool little giveaway and show my appreciation. So I love you guys very much. Keep well, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!